Hi, I'm M56. That stands for male number 56, which, let's be honest, is not a name befitting an animal like me. You may have heard of me, or maybe you haven't, but you really should have. I'm that guy who ran over 300 miles from Wyoming to achieve the title of first Wolverine to appear in Colorado in over 90 years. Along the way, I crossed the Wyoming Red Desert and arid lowlands, scaled numerous peaks, and crossed the Interstate 80, all in less than a month. Not content with that, I ran another 500 miles to North Dakota. Got an award there too, first Wolverine in 150 years. Still not impressed? Check out my friend M3, who scaled a near vertical mile over Mount Cleveland in 90 minutes in the middle of winter. Humans tried the same thing and uh, only made it a third of the way. So yeah, you really should have heard of me, but I get why you might not have. After all, even rugged outdoors people normally only see my footprints. There's also not a lot of us wolverines left in the lower 48 states. We were almost made extinct here about a century ago. And with climate change and shrinking wilderness, limiting the amount of habitat available to us, things are kind of tough. Right now, there are just 150 of us wolverines left in the entire lower 48. But, in case you hadn't noticed by now, we're rather tough. And there's a chance we could stage a comeback. New wolverines making it as far south as Colorado. Of course, you'd really have to try hard to know we're there. While well, I can chase a grizzly bear off its lunch, take down a moose, scale impossible slopes, and in almost every way punch above my 30 pound weight, I disappear into the mountains without a trace. And now I need your help. To the humans that can run through the wild for the sake of running as far and as fast as they can. To those that can scale vertical mountains without blinking. To the outdoors men and women who can brave the most extremes of our planet. I say, you and me both. Be a voice for us. Help us where we live now, but also to come home to the places where we belong. The places that you and I both call home. We can both represent healthy ecosystems, brimming with life. We represent the wild and we're meant to be here. Be a voice for the wild places that both of us love and help us survive. Help us come home.